G-Skyer Telescope, 70mm Aperture 400mm Oz Mount Astronomical Refracting Telescope for Kids Beginners, Travel Telescope with Carry Bag, Phone Adapter, and Wireless Remote. Hey guys this is Gadgets Mail a Review. Today I have a quick review for you. Obvious G Skyla 4mm Telescope. As you can see it uses the unit and. Pretty much everything is either make. Our metal or plastic so you can see here. Uses like really thick metal at 36 steel. You have here tripod that's also make. Out stainless steel this is the maximum. Hide yet you can have the tripod and so. The tripod can be folded up you can use. This place here to put a plate on it too. Keep track of a different accessory so. Here's the spotting scope. One thing I didn't like about your. Spotting scope is that the XT file. Pretty easy. Even to our tiniest really tough still. File. The idea is you supposed to remove is. When you're moving it around so that. Just doesn't fall out but you can just. Put it in there and I guess and they ask. You to make it short balance in the. Middle so here is all the different. Mounting mechanism a compromising style. You just have to tighten these up and. Keep it in place you have here the. Barrel and uses removable to have. Different adapter here is the 2x lens. Barrel and this is one of the IPCA uses. A 25mm eyepiece and there's two. Other one I found this one is the. Easiest to use has the biggest view and. It's pretty easy to use this one. So when you say telescope here you can. Use it to you know blog watching you can. Use it to spy on Beeble look at trees or. Birds or whatever and then you can also. Use this to look at the moon or the. Other night and I was able to catch the. Moon pretty well you get a full view of. Moon especially on a quarter moon or. Something like that you can see it's. Pretty well see the spot on the moon. Everything is pretty easy just use the. Spotting scope to get you line up and. Then use this guy to take a look so it. Has a little lens cap here you can. Actually take this and look to that and. If you want more light just take this. Whole cover up if you don't want any. Distraction so as you can see here uses. For a millimeter at f5 you see keep its. Cap on to keep border light from the. Outside from distracting but at night. You can just take this cap off so that's. A pretty story set up just rotate and. Loosen your snap and you can rotate. Around and when you get to the position. You want just tying this guy and you. Keep in place pretty well so here is the. Other 2 hour piece that you get uses a. 10 millimeter and this is a 5 millimeter. And they're pretty small these are. Pretty small to use I prefer to use the. Bigger size so here is the load of. Centerpiece that you can put everything. And I'll just head in place here and then. Just also keep the tripod very steady. The biggest problem I have when you. Telescope is just attachment here. I think if you're looking at the moon. For example if you pointing the. Telescope up like this and you're. Looking at the moon there's no. Adjustment. Here that you can you know. Put the earpiece straight up here too. Look at it so you have to kind of bend. Over to look at the eyepiece here I wish. That this and another attachment for you. To easily see is but usually when you're. Looking at stars on the moon it's going. To be pointed in the sky and then you're. Going to be looking at it sideways so. You have to bend over to look at yes. This is the highest tripod Google so if. The tripod was a little bit higher that. Will also help but of course this is the. Highest we go. So finally you have you sign up here too. Basically do some menu focus you can do. That right here slowly so just take your. Time and do that and it works pretty. Well overall this telescope works pretty. Well I think for the price is a pretty. Nice quality telescope of course you can. 
spend a little more to get the you know computerizing stuff but uses the manual version that you have to do everything yourself but yeah yeah i piece works pretty good and i prefer the again the 25 millimeter eyepiece has seemed to be the best easy working one for me so guys that's pretty much conclude my quick review use g sky telescope i hope we helped you in your budget decision you have any question let me know in a comment below and as always stay tuned for future review thank you